all of you amazing community leaders. Wow, this is a great crowd. Our community and San Francisco as a whole is a better, safer place because these people walk the earth. You guys are really the people that get things done in this fantastic city that is so diverse, has so many amazing people and cultures and amazing neighborhoods. Thank you for being the doers, not just the dreamers in San Francisco. We had your support. You guys really helped us in keeping this event going. We now have a world-class event in the Excelsior District that we could all be proud of, and that's Jerry Day. The Pink Triangle started out in 1996 as a renegade crafts project, and it's still going 15 years later. There are hundreds and hundreds and hundreds who have, who have volunteered over the years to install the Pink Triangle, 175 bright pink tarps, it's not easy to go out there after 8 o'clock at night when all the businesses are closed to go out there and paint. And they spent weeks producing these murals. Actually, in the Lower Haight had all participants helping us uh, raise the money for the challenge grant. For more than 20 years, Joe has led a community volunteer effort in Bernal Heights to keep graffiti vandals off the streets and sidewalks of their neighborhood. Joe recognized that the only way to defeat graffiti vandalism is to stay on top of it. And staying on top of it is what Joe is all about. The reason why this, this program and project was selected was because of their sustained commitment to beautifying and greening their neighborhood. It was a, a, a group effort, and we have very ambitious plans for the Bayview. We want the Bayview to be just as safe as anywhere else. We all together, new and old merchants really have a vision for a safe and vibrant neighborhood on the Divisadero Corridor. We're working hard to get all the business owners together, um, the neighborhood groups together. She is the best that there is. It's not my achievements, but it's a lot about my relationships with people who are working out in the neighborhoods. I thank you also for Friedel, who in some respects was kind of the grandmother of a lot of the causes that people here have uh, been responsible for building. Uh, SF Beautiful, she created in 1947 in connection with the cable car battle. For more than 30 years, Minnie was in the forefront leading the struggle against crime and drugs and illiteracy in her beloved Ocean View, Merced Heights, Ingleside neighborhoods. Working with her husband, Lovey Ward, Minnie stirred up residents, formed organizations, held countless meetings, and rallied political leaders in an effort to clean up the neighborhood. She was everything that a, a community activist should be. She was tenacious, yet she was gracious. Uh, she was very respectful of her adversaries. She was a great listener. She valued um, people of all walks of life. Uh, she valued the diversity of Hayes Valley. I'm a person of a few words. I'd just like to say, I thank you and Bud thanks you. And if he was here, he would be very, very proud. Thank you. Thanks to all you guys for your support. She would be so proud. Thank you so much. Thank you guys. Everyone, thank you so much. I appreciate it. It's amazing what a few individuals could do. Um, if you have the vision, the tenacity, and the perseverance, you can make anything happen.